Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to go totally solar. So in this new version of Solar Eclipse, uh, you have the ability to change some options on the way solar functions. And what I'm going to show you here is, by default, our company is set up right now as displaying your screens in what's called Classic Solar. And what I mean by that is your menu options at the top and your uh, buttons that we pre-configured for our company display at the top of the screen like this. This looks like the old solar version where you got your menu options you can click on and then your your this is kind of like your favorites but we call them our company favorites that we created as global for all employees. But this can be changed to look different in this new version of solar and that's what I'm going to show you. So <clears throat> if you go up to your name up here and click on the drop down and I'm sorry, not there. If you go to the gearbox right here and you go to solar preferences, down here where it says solar theme, click on that. You've got partially solar and total solar eclipse. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on total solar eclipse and click OK. And then I've got to sign completely out of a solar and then open it back up again. <clears throat> And just give it a minute. It's got to reload here. <clears throat> and what this is going to do is it's going to load solar clips and a new total solar. So the menus along the top and your company favorites or your favorites or your shortcuts, whatever you want to call those, uh, will be redesigned and in a new position on the screen. Let this finish loading here. Taking a minute. There we go. And I'll sign in. All right. So what I'm going to do to show you what the new total solar eclipse looks like is I'm going to go open up another sales order. And you can get an idea of what this looks like. And what you'll notice right away is I no longer have my menu option across the top. My menus come down the left hand side now. And you can unpin this if you would like to. So if you click that, and yours may be unpinned by default. You may open up the screen and it looks just like this. And you got your little hamburger menu over here with the three lines that look very similar to the way some apps run on your phone. You just simply hold your mouse over top of that and your menu pops up. So this is the same menu structure that you saw in Solar uh, Classic Solar Eclipse where it was going across the top, but now it's going down the side like your main solar window does over here. So your main solar window has everything going down the side here. You can now have that same functionality within other screens in Eclipse. Like I said, you can hold your mouse over that, click the pin button, and then once it's pinned, you can uh, click on these menu options, like if you need to edit the order and change the ship date or copy the order. It's the same menu options that you had in Classic Solar. The buttons that used to run across the top, the company favorites that we had, now they now show up under My Favorites. So you click on that, and then that's all those buttons that ran along the top of the screen in Classic Solar. You may like this new layout better, and if you do, you can switch to it. Uh, <clears throat> and this is just an example of one screen. We can jump into another one, such as Inventory Inquiry. Let's see here. I got it under my favorites, Inventory Inquiry. <clears throat> and here's your Inventory Inquiry screen. Same, same deal. Hold your mouse over that. There's all your different options in the menu structure. Now. I'm going to show you the other version real quick. So I'm going to go up to the gearbox here in Solar Preferences and I'm going to go to Partially Solar Eclipse and hit OK. And the same thing again. And I got to sign out and we got to go back over here and sign back into Solar again. And what Partially Solar Eclipse is, it's a combination between Classic and uh, full or total solar eclipse and 
personally right now I think I like this version better than uh, classic and I, and I think I like it better than uh, the total solar eclipse and I think many of you will agree with me on that so once this loads here I'll show you the difference <clears throat> and once again I'll just jump into sales order entry to give you a good idea of what it looks like So here is like I said, it's a combination of the two. And what I like is I like that my menu options are drop down items here. So back to like it used to be in classic solar. But you don't have your buttons going along the top. Your buttons, your or your company favorites or my favorites, whatever you want to call it, they go down the left hand side now. Not your menus, but just your 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 hot buttons or your quick buttons or whatever you wanted to call it. Uh, they're going down the left hand side now, and I really really like this because one reason is uh, you're kind of limited with space going across the top here. So some of those menu uh, items had to be abbreviated a whole lot, and they took up a lot of space. And you may have to drag your window out farther and farther to see all the different uh, icons that were up there. But now they just go down the left-hand side here, and I think they're a lot quicker and easier, and they stand out more. Um, than, and they were, they're not as cluttered across the top. But when you need to get to the, some of those more advanced options in sales order entry or any other screen, you have your menu buttons right here at the top to get to them quickly as well. So right now, personally, I'm, I'm really liking the, the partially solar eclipse. And once again, you can do the same thing where you can unpin that uh, so it collapses. And all you got to do is just simply move your mouse over here to the left-hand side. And it, you don't have to click or anything. It automatically appears. And then if you, so if you needed to convert this to a bid, just hold your mouse over that and click on bid. And it will change the order to a bid status. So that's uh, that's. The difference between totally solar clips, partially solar, and then classic. And of course, you can switch between all these that you want to. And if you don't like something and want to go back, you just go up to your uh, gearbox up here and go to solar preferences and just switch back and forth between the one. Company default for us will be classic solar clips. Thank you.